Hello everyone, this is Sean Thomas on Official PvP Hardcore Server 385, and today we are making Who. So as you see, I've got a pig in front of me, Sir Pig Slayer of Sarkos. He defeated a Sarko and was thusly named. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and spam Stemberries. You're going to click on the Stemberry, then use Remote Use Item. Make sure you're using this on the pig and not yourself. It will dehydrate you, and it will take away his food when you use it on him. It will also upset his tummy and he will provide you with lots and lots of poo. I do a stack of stem berries at a time, pick up the poo, it doesn't, uh, doesn't last but more than uh, it looks like a minute and a half on the ground. So we're going to go ahead and pick up all this poo and then we'll do it again. Alright, so you remote use the item. You could walk around your animals and pick up their poo. It just makes it so much easier when you use a pig, stem berries, and all the poos in one spot for you. So if you're about the business of making fertilizer, this is the way to do it. Alright, so we have covered the ground in a slimy brown substance. Let's go ahead and pick it all up. Thank you. And, uh, whoop, brown eggs. Alright, so we're going to carry our heavy load over to the nearest compost bin. And for a compost bin, it takes 50 thatch and 3 poo to make one fertilizer. If you hover above the item in your inventory you'd like to transfer and push T, it will quickly transfer it from you into whatever inventory you're looking at, whether it be a dinosaur or a container. Alright, so we got some more compost bins over here. So you hover over, push T, transfer that thatch over, and then hover over the poo, transfer up to six, so that yes, that will give you enough for two composts per uh, two of the uh, fertilizer bags per compost bin. So we want to fill all these up. Now it takes an hour per fertilizer that's generated. So 50 thatch and three poo will take one hour to turn into a fertilizer bag. So what we're looking to do here is create a whole bunch at the same time, come back and get lots and lots of fertilizer. And you might ask, what's the fertilizer used for? If you're looking to plant either berries, advanced crops, or plant X seeds, then you're going to need lots and lots of fertilizer. One fertilizer will last you a week on a plant X, and we'll show you those in a moment here. So I ran out of poo. I'm just going to grab this one to finish off. I'll come back when I've got more stem berries and do the rest, just because I don't want to walk around picking up poo behind all these swiping tails. Alright. So we're going to hike back over. In the distance you can see some Plan X. And those are our organic turrets. We are on a PvP hardcore server and so we need defenses. Alright, so we're going to hit that ladder, climb to the top, and let's take a look at these. So Plan X require a large plot berries require uh, any size so small will do and then advanced crops the same will go small or medium for advanced crops so we got two bags of fertilizer in these so this is going to take roughly two weeks for this plant to run out of fertilizer uh, a little bit quicker if it's firing on a target so we'll go ahead and put another bag in this one since it's chewed through most of the first bag and what we're doing is we're accessing the inventory of the crop plot not the plant itself so if you hover over the plant and push E, you're given the spindle of options. You can put it to sleep where it won't use any resources. You can change the range of the attack. And then you can also change what kind of target will attack. So ranges are low, medium, and high. I recommend leaving it on high. And then uh, changing target to all targets will fire on all, all critters that come within range, except for your friendlies. And uh, if you want to change it to players only, so if I tune it to all targets, it's now on all targets. Now it gives me the option to do tamed creatures and players only. And then I can switch over to only targeting players. So it's good to have a mix of targeting players and tamed creatures. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, please hit like. If you'd like to see additional content and be notified when content's available, subscribe. It's free to do. And I'll be happy to put out additional content for you if you have any comments as to what you'd like to see. I'm open for suggestions. Have a good one.